Um, <laughs> this is madness. Well, this isn't rehearsed. Like, I definitely oh. thought you were going to be better at this. No, I told you I was rubbish at this. Hello, everybody. I'm Karen Bartlett. I'm Chef Aaron Butler. We've teamed up with Hafner Sausages and Belfast Curvy School to bring you this highly competitive sausage-based cook-off in celebration of National Sausage Day on the 30th of April 2024. It's going to be a great time. There's going to be slicing, chopping, sizzling, burning, acid, salt, all of the above. It's going to be a great time. And at the end of this, I'm going to win. So, Arn, uh, tell us about what you're making. Yes, Arn, let's cook. Uh, ah. I am going to be cooking today uh, what I would call a sausage roll, but it's a little bit of a twist on a sausage roll, Karen. It's like, I would call it like a ghetto sausage roll, like right. homemade. Like it's like, cause Straight roll? Yeah, because we're not going to be using puff pastry today. Instead, we're going to be swapping that out for a tortilla wrap, and that's less calories, which be a little more healthy for you. Uh, but it's also Is it just- Is less calories, a wrap? A wrap is less calories than a puff pastry. I would be near certain. Chef Ian, can this you is, confirm or deny? A wrap is less calories. This is In I, your face. This is what I've been doing wrong. You don't speak to Chef on I got again. <laughs> All right. Hey, big boy. Come here. Look at you, big boy. Hey, you donkey. Tell me about these half Here's the thing. See, if you're going to make a sausage dish, you want a good quality sausage. You want a sausage with good meat and a good bite in it. And that is what our friends at Hafner's have provided us with today. True. And that's what I'm going to be using. I assumed we were just going to pan fry all the sausages here, but you're doing something totally different. The way my dish works is I have a lot of prep in my dish. We're not going to be frying them on the pan. Mine won't say go into the oven, but your dish is going to be going onto the pan. Mine's what is more, your dish? I'm sort of pimping up a sausage soda. So I'm going to take soda bread. We're going to load it with some avocado smash with like we bit of chili, we bit of coriander, we bit of lime, we bit of we taste the Mexico there. Oh, very nice. And then yeah. we're gonna we're gonna put busted sausages across it. That's when you fry a sausage and then butter flat, if you will. Yep. And then poached egg on top of that. This is terrifying what you're doing here, by the way. Why? Just it's scary to see scissors being used in this way. What to cut a sausage? Yeah, I would normally use it for crafts. Um, scissors. <laughs> what sort of crafts are you <laughs> doing? Uh, do you ever see a big art attacks on the mountain? That's me. <laughs> Here's a question though, is it, is it not easier to squeeze it out? First let's find, well, let's, let's find, find out. Let's find out. Well, I'd try to squeeze this yeah, out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a wee poo? See if this works. Well, I wouldn't have said that to be fair, but... but I'm just saying. Sort of, here, that works. That works. Does it? There is a danger that you'll break them or break the skin. It works, know? but it'll, it feels weird to me. Yeah, yeah. I don't feel... I feel like I'll have to go to church after this, <laughs> if I'm being honest. So, what... Um, have a residency where, where did you get the? Where did you get the idea for this dish? Oh, you know me, Karen. I'm always in my kitchen being creative, coming up with new, innovative watching, ways. Watching videos on TikTok. Watching videos on TikTok. This yeah. was strictly from a TikTok video. I'm pretty sure right. I've left more sausage meat in you that did, skin. You did. The, your, um, your, that was your, your technique. Your way was better. Well, yeah, I would better than that. What's your cooking background then? Oh, well, I'm a single male of 35 years old, so it's pretty much just hopes and dreams. Karen is what gets cooked in my house every uh, evening. Your, your goose is cooked? That's, <laughs> that's what you're trying to tell us. Yeah. What, uh, what does that mean though? Because earlier when we were talking about you behind your back, we were saying <laughs> the, the, the single hood at 35 could either mean you're an amazing chef yeah. or it could mean that you're burnt lot. You know, because our Kevin, God love him, He's single and he's 44, but he um, he can't really cook. And now he'll he be... has that cooking app on his phone, doesn't he? A gr app? grinder, that one. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So what, what would be like a standard arm butler cooking for yourself in the house dinner? Usually it is something that's quick, something that's fast, something that's easy. To be fair, wraps actually play a, a big role in that. Because they're versatile, you can put a lot of different things in. Chicken, sausage, ham, whatever. Chicken, sausage, or ham? Chicken, sausage, or, or ham for a wrap, yeah, yeah. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get this sausage meat that I've cut, I've cut four of these sausages up and I think that's enough meat. Do you that's, think that's yeah, enough? Yeah, for how many wraps are you making, two? Oh, one. The, make uh, the, one wrap? I, I'll make as many as you want me to make, don't you? Do you want two? I want to see two. <laughs> Yeah. Well, I'm doing, I'm doing a full soda for it, so that's going to be two halves. Yeah. What's the most important part of cooking, Karen? Seasoning. Se do you know what the most important yes. part of seasoning is? Layers. Yeah. You want to season it in layers. See people that try to correct bad seasoning by salt and things at the end. Now, I'm going to use Foolish. salt, paprika. Chef Ian said earlier you shouldn't do pepper until it's cooked. Ian, should I leave the pepper out for this? Your sausage is going on the inside, so yes. Put a little bit of pepper in now. Good. See, that's, that's why you consult the professionals. Oh, no, yes. You know yeah, I mean? I, you just gotta make sure. Can I salt by this? 
Yeah. Not a bit of salt went in there. But you can, by see, the way, why, you can see why they pay him the big bucks. There's then. more down but, my yeah, sleeve right now. He uncovers the elbow. <laughs> That's what you yeah. did wrong. Yeah. Well, we'll never do that again. See the way I season food, by the way, Karen. I eyeball it. See, oh, all, I. see all this measurements? Oh, no. No, you're better eyeballing it. I'm eyeballing it. I'm doing it from a height. Because cooking's an art, Karen. Is this like sweet paprika or is it smoked? Just, Just standard, standard paprika. Yeah. And I'm not going to use too much of this because I don't want to. You're eyeballing the paprika as well. That's risky. Eyeballing everything. Listen, I'm a risky guy, all right? I'm a 35 year old <laughs> male that lives on his own. You know how it is. I'm going to integrate. I'm going, I'm going to need, you can't look at me needing. He's I'm a needing, risky guy. I'm needing the sausage. I've heard you made. say before, I need sausages. I've heard you've said that, you know? <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, it's usually in a WhatsApp text at two in the morning. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, Arm. I'm all for your creativity. Yeah. I hate watching you need that. Not Why? <laughs> I don't know. Why? There's a bit of skin I can throw There's what? <laughs> oh no. This oh, they got me. I'm not touching that, that's you. That's Why? all you. I'm not touching that. above your rehead. <laughs> That's, um, a, that's a kitchen nightmare right there. <laughs> so I've got my sausage meat all there. It's seasoned. I'm happy with that. Uh, you're, now, now you're contaminating the rest of the kitchen. I'm contaminating the rest of the kitchen. Look, the skin's all you need to get that off the bowls. You're not just look, you're dropping it everywhere. <laughs> you're, you're the salmonella Karen, king. Like, I feel you? like you need to bring your energy down just a little bit for me. I feel like you're just being a bit aggressive. Apart from the actual sausage meat, what's going into this, this wrap? Into the wrap, we're going to layer down the sausage meat. We're going to put a little sprinkling of mozzarella cheese, and then we're going to finish it with some hot honey in the middle of the wrap. Oh, and okay. I, by the way, I have zero slicing, cutting, any technique. So what, whatever way this ends up will be fun. I would have rolled it into a wee cigarette chip. That's what I would have <laughs> And smoked it? Yeah. I'm perturbed watching you at my farm. Mate, I am, I am making a mess of this. Do you know I, what? Do you know what's good, though? I'm very confident. I'm very confident that when it's my turn for this bit, please God, don't let me cut my hands off. I know that I'm gonna be slightly better than that. Now I've got, look at this, oh, see? That, that is a wee bit cross choppy. Now we're getting to the reason. <laughs> <laughs> are, you, are you putting any of the sage into this? Or? Yeah, I'm, I'm about to. And Karen, the, similar to my uh, seasoning technique. From a height, we drop it in. Karen, we're not doing exact uh, measurements uh, here. I know you're not. Because we want we want the flavors to come out. Now the good thing is my meat is all done there. I'll show it to the overhead camera, get a good look at that. Does this mm. need to go into the oven next? This doesn't go into the oven till I, I'm ready for it to go into the oven. We're putting this to the side for a second, right. right? I need to get my egg wash. Oh, here. If you thought me cutting things was impressive, you wait and see until I, I crack an egg. You have to crack the egg with one hand. Oh, oh one handed crack iron, or else it's not real. I don't know if I can do the one hand, but here. We'll find out. Let's so see. Aaron's going to try the one-handed crack, which actually used to be his nickname in West Belfast. That's uh, uh, my name on Tinder, if you look <laughs> it up. Just the old one-handed crack, and then... Yay! Here, that's pretty good. Oh! I shake Chef that. Butler! I don't think I could... Here, fart in there, just... And then I'm going to whisk it up. Uh, do you, you know what's mad? That's a mini whisk for Aaron, but it's an actual size whisk for my <laughs> wee hands. <laughs> Have you got a wee brush at all for Bit of salt, bit of salt in your egg wash. Oh, yeah. Bit of salt, bit of I think. Salt. What does the salt do then in the egg wash? Just, I would never do that. It just seasons it. Right, okay. Yeah, we're going to season our egg wash with our uncontaminated egg hand. See if you're doing egg wash then for something that's sweet, should you put a wee bit of sugar on it? Yeah, and just use the yolk. That's good knowledge, I didn't know that. So look, we're just gonna give this a wee extra bit of a whisk. But like I know some things, but I wish I knew more things. Do you know what I mean? Like more like- Are you speaking about cooking or are you just speaking about <laughs> life? Um, I can't believe the process is going on here. Oh, right. you wait and see the salmonella that comes out of this. Do you be worried about stuff like that in the house? See, you have to remember, I'm reheating right, packaged right. food in my house. Right. I'm not making fresh stuff like this. This will never happen again for, this is like, the millennium. Right, okay. You know what I mean? Right, yeah. You can rubber it Great. or you can go natural. Oh, uh, okay. see what you've done I mean there. here, <laughs> if you give me that option, <laughs> I'm, always, I'm always going natural. <laughs> right, I think it's time for me to get one of the stars of the the dish here. The ra I can't even open this pack. Steady you doing that, by the way, but also use the Kinef to... I am as weak as Mr. Burns. Just be careful, Jesus. Well, every time you take a knife in your hands, I worry. I'm not a chef that Deals in technique, Karen. I, it's I'm all a, expression. It's all art. Oh, you actually bit right. Sorry, so you're actually. Are going, you are you getting it now? You're actually baking this in the wrap. Yeah, madness. Uh, unbelievable. Madness. Right, I worry about lots of lots of things about that. I'm going to start off with maybe. What, what would you describe the size of ball you're making there? Oh. Like a like a like a tennis ball, smaller. Bit bigger. Bigger like, than a tennis. Like a hurley. <laughs> You've never played tennis, have you? That's that's smaller than a tennis ball. The faces in the gallery here, by the way, just. <laughs> People are sitting like this, Arm. 
Kieran, you invited me on. I to know, do this. but here I'm not. I here. told you on the phone that I can't cook, and you went, it'll be great. <laughs> it'll sure it'll be all right. Let me tell you, they'll be talking who's, about who's this. Who's the worst cook that you know? There's a famous story in the comedians community uh, on one Shane Todd <gasps> who. Who, Lick, he licked tastes, he, who, he licked tests chicken, doesn't he? We call him the human th- thermometer. Yeah. Because he uses his tongue to test whether or not chicken is raw. This though is, this is... What's um, wrong with this? You're, you're competing with Shane, like... Excuse me, it just, what is it, wrong with this? It doesn't look appetizing, that's what I would say. You can't base a dish, Cairn, on no, the no. pros. You gotta base it on the finished product, okay? Yeah. Now, I'm not going all the way to the edge here because I'm gonna egg wash and let that so we have something to fold over with. Now what I'm gonna do is, this is my winning ingredient right here. This is the key to me beating you today, let me tell you. The sweetness, the hotness, the savouriness, it's all gonna come together in a barrage of flavours, okay? A barrage. Now, I am gonna, a Nigel barrage <laughs> of flavours <laughs> right now. <laughs> he loved that. I did love he that. He absolutely like loved that. Political uh, banter mixed with the kitchen ingredients. Now, I wanna just drizzle, so I'm gonna go slow. You're dangerously close to touching the nib of that onto the raw um. sausage made <laughs> From a height, from a height. Oh, you know what I'm Oh, like? you picked up a bit of cheese. Milk. That's okay. Now is the egg wash time. Why am I egg washing, Karen? Do you know why? Is it the glue it down? Exactly. The egg wash is serving as our glue. So when I roll this bad boy up, we're getting no leakage. I'm, I'm terrified, Art. I'm going to start rolling this up now. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Do you want now, me to sing that when you're doing it? I've never did this before in my life. So I'm just sort of hoping. Like what you dabbed some of that Karen, on the what board. board. What do you mean dabbed some of it? Like I'm, doing, I'm doing art right. Right Who's down to taste a bit of iron? I need to cut this now. Where cut is... it now? Yeah. Not after? I'm cutting it in pieces. How many pieces you do? I don't know. We'll see how many I get. Do you want me to do? I, here, I don't want you to do anything. I just, I want everyone to get out of here safely today. That's what I want. I that's, worry that's that you're... That's not going to happen. Do you remember the adverts he used to do for sausages where like the guy's face was blurred out because he didn't cook it the whole way through? That's what I think this is going to be for you. No. This is going to be the time you poisoned four people. <laughs> Just, it would never occur to me to do this. This is crazy to me. The tension in the room. Do you know why? Because... Why? Because you, you use a knife the way a child would oh, use it. Oh, we ruined So one. it's terrifying. Don't I'll try that He's one. Out. No, you're trying to I'll try this one. The, I'll try. No, you're trying to take this one. Ben, Ben, Ben. There we go. There's the first utilization of the bin. The bin. I mean, the log in the bin. How many did you get then? Six? Oh, don't All sort that of language. uneven. So the good thing is that they'll, they'll cook unevenly as well. Kieran, so. it's rustic. You don't know what rustic cooking is. <laughs> I don't. Rustic I'm, is when you're, 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 you're old. Oh, I'm technique. fine dining. No, you're, I'm fine dining when you, you see me knocking Take your this. fine dining away Sauce, from me. Sort of uh, do you know what I'm going to do finally? I'm going to put some egg wash on the actual outside of them to give them a wee bit of a golden. Oh, we crossed? We crossed on the gold. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You wouldn't, you wouldn't want all that raw sausage meat to be uncrusted, you see? whenever it comes out. Yeah, you don't want all this raw sausage meat and raw egg yeah. to not cook properly. Yeah. Right, I think I'm ready to put these on a pan. Do you know what's great? To... And I do mean this from the bottom of my heart. Okay. Thanks for being awful at this because mine <laughs> will comparatively look sensational. Listen. See, if I, I, could, I could literally chuck those eggs at the wall and people would be happier trying it. I swear to God. This is, this is, do you know what? This you is, sound like I'm holding these people hostage to taste this. This is terrifying. Say that was on the menu in a restaurant, would you order it? Hasn't been cooked yet. Hasn't Sausage cooked meat yet. wraps. Hasn't been cooked yet. With cheese and honey. Hasn't been cooked yet. What's the oven directions for anybody watching home who's dying to try this? We're going into the oven, 200 degrees, and uh, Four. we're eyeballing it. Till it's cooked. Till it's cooked. Till, till, it's cooked. till it doesn't 200. look, till it doesn't look pink anymore. 200. Here, do you know what? The good thing is the thick sausage meat like that'll cook roughly at the same rate as the tiny thin tortilla. I'm gonna drizzle too much of that there. Um. <laughs> this is madness. What? Do you know what's mental about this? This isn't rehearsed. Like I definitely oh. thought you were gonna be better at this. No, I told you I was rubbish at this. You're the sort of person though that would say to somebody, I can't really dance, and then you cut shapes. Do you know what I mean? But this is. No, I authentically meant it. I don't know why I'm doing this. It's good to give it a wee bit of coverage, yeah. John, we'll get the fire extinguisher on hand. Yeah. Just, yeah. Just. Can I put these on, Chef Ian? Yes, you fire away. Yes, Chef Ian. Yes. Chef Ian yes. loves it. Chef Ian's making sure they've got insurance for this. That's well, what do he's doing. you know doing. what? I should actually do this, and then that way I can egg wash the other side of it. Don't, don't, no, but the bottom side doesn't need egg wash, surely. Does it not? Chef Ian wants me to do it on my round. You don't need to uh, egg wash the bottom. No. See? Particularly now you, you don't? put five gallons boiled on it. No, no. no. Pass. That's you here, listen. It's Karen. I present to you my uncooked dish. Oh, look at that. Do you sure do you not not want to eat that? You know what I mean? I'm gonna go put this in the oven. Right. Okay. While I do that, you do. I get ready. You do here. you. Do you know we'll clear up some of your stuff. Okay. Mm. 
My dish is in the oven, everything is going swimmingly and there's not a fault happening. Uh, what temperature are you looking for on that cook chef? I'm looking to get like a medium rare sausage coming out of the sausage roll. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You ever have a medium rare sausage roll? I've had a couple of dodgy sausages in my time. Like oh, I. if anyone has it, say it's yeah. <laughs> You've definitely it, had your first share. We're gonna start here. I've got a wee bit of oil in the pan. Mm. So while it's heating up, I'm gonna uh, run the knife here through this chili. Oh, I'll check it. Oh, look at this. You lose. Show off here. You lose. Now. You lose. Oh, right? I've used a knife before. Oh, why? No, I think oh, that's why? more than enough. Oh, I'm married. Oh, great. You know what I mean? <laughs> but then that's what you're doing right now. Now, some people would tell you when you touch raw chili like that, make, make sure you wash your hands. Don't before, touch your eyes. Before you touch your eye or your eye. I'll set that there for now. We're going to do a wee bit of coriander. We're going to Mexico. Here, we're doing all right here for time and all. This look is at good. This. Oh, well done. You've cut two things, class. <laughs> Oh, I know, but at least here, Search the chef. We notice, have an notice, artist here. Notice, notice the way I cut them. Someone phone Paul Rankin and tell him that Karen cut two things. Oh, here, I want to hear a sizzle. Um, oh, that's, a, that's a vague sizzle. I wanted, I wanted more drama. Yeah, I wanted a I bit wanted, more. Do you know what? I'll let it heat up a wee bit more before I let that. I'm not, do you know what? I'm going to go up to an eight. No, I'm not very good at the one handed crack, but I will try it once. Yeah, I. You, you, know did, it, you did it. You did it. I, I committed. There you go. Don't get oh, any shell in there. Oh, my hand. It's I'm, so small. I'm going to be looking. Do you know what? Oh, um, I see so much shell. I oh my god. I busted the yolk. I he it. busted the yolk. I fucked it. It's maybe a poached egg. I can't do it, yeah. He busted the yolk. Yeah. There, there you we go. go. Two -handed He's crack. two handed. He can't do it one handed. I've two handed it. See, no matter two what. Two hands, no shell. Or no matter both. what happens when we leave today, I was able you to want, crack you a one handed egg. I, I, I want the yolk. Look at, I oh know, yep, yep. Oh, your sauce is burning. It is burning. What are you doing? Big boy, come on. Do you know what? When it's brown, it's cooked. The oil is burning. Say, I shouldn't have gone from that six iron, that's you. <laughs> I'm gonna buckle on about four or five of these. Yeah. I'm gonna buckle, do you know what we're doing? Six. Yeah, okay. We'll see what happens. All right. It's good that that one's already cooked. Well, it is, it is, but here, that'll be the first one out, so don't worry about it. Do you need to prep anything else? No. Oh, I do. Yeah. I and nearly thanks. forgot about my wee uh, homemade guac that I'm doing here. Uh, oh, you're gonna, yeah, your homemade guac? Now, you have to be vaguely confident when you're doing an avocado. This is always a chance for you to take a finger off. We were discussing earlier this wee trick, and I've never really done it, because I'm always shit scared. I like killing myself with it, but... Oh no, I can't do it. I, I'm not doing it. You're afraid. Do it. I'm, I'm, you already afraid. ruined the yolk. You ruined I'm the afraid. yolk. Don't. There's, this isn't the time for you to be taking risks. Stay in your comfort zone, sure. A, a beta, a beta, a beta zone. meal. I'm, well, here. You know what I mean? I'm standing my comfort zone. Don't you take zone. any risks like I did? No. It why? is a risk, though. I actually am risking fingers. What did you risk? <laughs> I risk you're, you're everything. Re I risk oh, your I life. I can't do that, no. I'm not, I, I'm not that guy. I'm not that guy. Oh, look go. at you plumping look out. Look at that. Look at that. Stone's out. <laughs> Stone's out. You, you give birth to the stone the way you did it there. <laughs> the avocado was crowning. Look, look at that though. Here, we're, we're good. Everything's happening. Are we good? It's all happening. Straight in. Like I said, you know, I do what you're comfortable with, sure. These are burning. John, know they are burning. There's a lot on here, Ar. Here, I know there is, mate. Listen. Here, it's hard, isn't it? I've turned it down too much now. It's hard, isn't it? Do you know what? It's harder than it looked. <laughs> so Kieran is in the process of rimming his sausages in the pan. Take whatever you want from that. Back to the guac. Back to Se the multitasking. Seasoning. Well seasoning. Done. Seasoning. Se seasoning. You're just saying. I'm just. Like. I know. Good. You were saying you don't really cook iron. I'm. Uh, I would describe myself I mean, as a, an amateur talent. That's what I would describe right? myself. Right. An undiscovered. Of. Oh, I've been discovered. Um, <laughs> Did the SSE twice last year, mate, whatever, and um, I'm I... didn't cook in front of it. <laughs> you didn't do a live oh, demo of Karen. Oh, but I sizzled. <laughs> oh, I sizzled on you that. You some jokes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So then I'm going to go in with a wee touch of seasoning here. Oh, oh did, you get, did you get spot on? I got spot on by your that's sausage. A full, that's a full nightmare. <laughs> and then we're in with this stuff as well. Now I'm going. Listen to that. That's you ASMR. Hold on. I'm doing it. Look at that. Oh, everything's in there now. Huh? I, I really hope I don't get burns on my face from doing this. I'm going to do a wee, a wee bit of lime juice. And then we're whisking this. All right. Oh, oh, Lennon. There's something sensual about the way you squeeze a lime. Thank you. Any wonder you're married. <laughs> I do. What a lucky woman, eh? I know. Here's, <laughs> she, she didn't know her luck whenever uh, I showed up at her house with a lime and an avocado. <laughs> One thing, it, one thing I didn't see you doing, Aaron, and of course you couldn't, because you put uh, raw sausage meat on everything, was this. Oh, look at this. A wee taste test. That's a good goddamn time. That was a big taste test. <laughs> you had a full spoon in your mouth there. I would say I'm alright at a bit of cooking. Chloe's funny about sausages. She's deeply fearful of eating raw sausage meat. Mm. So, <laughs> this is true. I can hear her laughing, but this yeah. is true. She'll stick sausages on for like 45 minutes in the oven mm. and go, Kieran, can you look at these? Is that cooked? And I'm in going, 
I see when they're black cylinders, they're cooked. Would you ever cook like... Kieran, I'm telling you this right now. <laughs> you don't you, cook? You, you love keep trying to get me to say, yes, man, I cook all the time. Sure, I love cooking for the family. We do a barbecue every year. I've never cooked in my entire What's life, the most you? people you've ever cooked for? Seriously. I once cooked spaghetti in my house and right. with me, mum and dad. I followed a recipe on YouTube where they use wine, which is fine, oh, you can re reduce the wine. But then they finish the spaghetti off with one cup of milk. And apparently that was bad. I would think that's stinking. What's Chef Ian? Never heard of that ever. Well, there you no, go yeah. then. Yeah. Do, you know who's, do you know whose recipe it was? And you can look it up because it's still on YouTube right now. Who? Oh, Gordon. Not Sting, Gordon Ramsay. Uh, I was going to say, Sting would never do that. Um, no, he doesn't. If there's one thing I know, it's what's, <laughs> what Sting does in the kitchen. Yeah, yeah. So, do you reckon these are good to go into the oven now? Or? Absolutely, yeah. yeah. Can I just say, before you put this in the oven, those look great. Thank you. And I'm, so I'm annoyed that they, they look that good. Do you know it looks great? Do you know it tastes great? That should. I don't know. That doesn't right look there. good to me. Can I give you that just because I'm terrified of it? Get it. Does that not look or like a ninja would never, turtle threw up? I'd never travel that no. far with Sorry. a half hand in my what life. What say about that? I would burn people. Did you say it looks... No, that's great. I'm not No, that looks like a Ninja Turtle boat. Is what that looks like. It doesn't look on like that, but I'll tell you what, it tastes good. <laughs> yeah, aren't your sausage rolls are ready? They're just... Oh, shut the front they, door. They are looking Exciting. superb. They actually are. This is, this is big talk. We've just, got, <laughs> we've just got word that my sausage rolls are out of the oven and they are... Chef Ian himself has said they look superb. So, eat it, Karen. Oh, can we have our... our Sodas grilled, please. Oh, look at him getting the chef to grill oh, yeah, the sodas sure. for him. Oh, chef, would you do my work for me? This guy. Okay. So, chef, um, I love when you grill my sodas. <laughs> I, I'm I, jealous because I formed I'm, a rapport with Chef Ian. <laughs> <laughs> We're um, both vying for Chef yeah, Ian's love right uh, now. Uh, I'm going to put a wee bit of vinegar in this water because... Chef Ian, are you tasting a wee, yeah. wee bit? Yeah. Oh, I like Chef, chef, chef Ian was saying earlier, have you put a wee bit of vinegar? into your poaching water. Is that, that, the, is that what, how much you would put in? Ah, I think so. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. You're giving me grief about I know, but it, it's, he was saying it helps cook the egg white so it all stays together because this was going to say, see when you go to poach an egg, you obviously want the yolk to be soft, you want the white to be cooked, but you also see whenever the white tries to separate from the yolk mm. and you know, it looks like, um, you know, the ghost of Christmas past in the Muppets Christmas Carol. You know, yeah. that they are what they are, do not blame me. And it's all poached egg flour. I will lose this contest if you never do that again. <laughs> <laughs> Karen's doing a dirty tactic where can I by delaying his cooking so my sausage rolls get a wee bit colder. I'm not happy about it. I see what he's doing. He's like, oh, do I do it now? You know, he knows what. What do you reckon? When's good? Let it boil. One wee second. So it it's known as a rolling boil. Right. Roll that in. People love it. Ro right. Roll boil. Roll from, boil. Uh, rolling, <laughs> rolling boil. Right. You've poached so, eggs before, haven't you? I have, but I, I do I do mangle it occasionally. Like. Okay, so you're gently folding it into the middle. Right, okay, here we go. Gently, now. gently. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, the fear. Yeah, yeah. It's real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it. see, this is what happens. Look, and now it's you're the, too aggressive. Now it's the fucking ghost of Christmas past. Look at it. You're too right. aggressive. Yeah. See, that's not too bad. It's that isn't awful. So, Hold on, let's just get rid of this. Yeah, it looks like right. that sausage skin I had earlier. Yeah, you need to get rid of the scrapies. Do you know what I hate? Do you ever go to a restaurant and you order one? And it comes out and the white isn't cooked properly and it's all like inside. I hate that. It, what's it doing? I hate that. <laughs> if an egg ever does that at me, I'll never eat it. Sausage is ready, so that one minute. Right. I'm going to show you a proper one. one. Oh, do, um, yes, yeah. show us a proper yeah, one. Yeah, let's get yeah. in and here's have another. Egg. Have another bowl. Because oh, there we you go. put it with your finger and push with your thumb. Right. Okay. Interesting. What's your technique, mate? Okay. Oh, look at this. Right, pushing and pulling. That's what I did. Oh. That's exactly what I did. And then oh, the was bit great. of shell was there for a bit of extra protein. Oh, that's great. Is it weird if I call you dad? Um, <laughs> Cause I'm <laughs> near Ian. Just to check. I, I sort of... Okay, so we... Sh oh, now look at that. That looks yeah. really good. That looks good. A wee bit more. A wee bit more. Wee bit more? Or 37 seconds precisely. Oh, wow. Right, 37 seconds precisely. Get the precisely. countdown timer on, huh? <laughs> What about this? What are we doing? Huh? Are you counting Mississippi or is it just... <laughs> <you straight there? laughs> I've lost no count. one's default and is Mississippi. I go 1, 1,000, 2, 1,000. But like, do you know what's mental? I've totally lost count now. So it's been in there 20, for 8 minutes. 20, <laughs> 23, 24, 25, 10, but 9, I think 8, it's good. 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Oh, oh. that looks good. Oh. That looks good. We egg. Looks like a wee alien baby, doesn't it? You want that jiggle, don't you? Oh. We, we panna cotta egg, right? We dab one there. Oh, the fear. 
care. The fear that it breaks at this point. Look at him. <gasps> doesn't care about the audience. Oh, pro. Here, do you know what? We're getting that one in, in there. Look at that. Up the I've had the temptation that. for me to know, just go like that. Here, it's so hard not that to will, do. That works well for me, right? Okay, so my sausage going, rolls are freezing right now. We're going with the uh, the rose on. Here we go. A gentle. And in. Oh, mate. It's all happening here. Now, that, one looks better. that one looks it better. That one looks better. I'm excited because I know that I've done a job. I'd oh, say, mate, you'll never do that again in your there's life. There's a lot less on this one. Yeah. And a lot more, you know, a lot more. I, that one's a wee bit more Copacabana. The other one was a wee bit more Andy time. <laughs> you know, this is, this is... Copacabana time? <laughs> no, that was all right. I really tried. It was all right. Is there anything more exciting for people to watch than two other grown men just watching an egg? Just look, look, looking post egg one. <laughs> It's, yeah. good one, it? it's a good one. It's amazing. We'll do a wee test on this one. Sure, you know what cheese. Now, like. see, look, that's in danger. There, that's, see, that that still needs to get know, that I'm back gonna, in I'm the water. I'm going to turn that wee bit over because that was dodgy in move, Karen. There was a bit of the white was in danger of being a hashtag snatter egg, and that's not what we're here for. No. Uh, we're here for perfectly cooked albumin. What do we reckon? Right, you're still quite raw on there. Yeah. It's still raw. Hard to do. There's that. a trick. <laughs> oh, oh, Jesus. Oh, oh Jesus, stop it. That's unreal. Chef Ian with the save. It's these wee things that I. No, you're going on tangents. You need to count. I know. I'm mm. on five, one thousand, six, <laughs> one thousand. What do we reckon, Chef? I think it looks. We're in good shape. Yeah, I think we're looking good there. Oh, we're looking good. I'm excited, Arn, to win. Fair. Oh, here, do you know what? They're both great. Right, right. so if, if, uh, if we can clear I this end, we'll, we'll, we'll play it, please. Yeah. We're ready to play it. You have to do that with excited clap for the chefs too. Right, spot on. Thanks. So, our dishes are now cooked and we're going to plate up. Iron sausage rolls, have to say, look a hell of a lot better than I thought they were going to. Mm -hmm. Mine's going to be sensational, my eggs are unbelievable. It's not how you start, Karen. it's how you finish. I think I'm actually sharpening the same side over and over again there, but there we go. Now, my plating up is very easy because I literally just have to put it on a plate. Maybe a couple of wee fresh uh, sage leaves on that. Oh, now you're talking, oh, Chef. Now you've stolen my idea because I already had my coriander leaves prepped for mine. No, 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 I came up with it, remember? Yeah. I said it. That looks great, aren't we? Yeah, I'm you. still scared that it won't be cooked on the inside, but I'm trusting it will. Look, the chef Ian doesn't want to kill anybody as much as I maybe, don't want maybe to do it. garnish a piece of chef cuisine that is overlooked, but it is not overlooked in this kitchen. Our good friend, the hot honey, comes back into play for our garnish. Okay. Gives that little bit of extra kick. There we go. So I, 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 I didn't want to splooge it everywhere, you know? I wanted to just make sure it came out in a nice thin Oh, dressing. here. I've, I've got mine. I know what I'm doing. Straight on with that avocado. Be generous. <laughs> right, Arn, I see to be honest with you, I, I just know that this is better. No, no Kieran, no, no chance. It is. Kieran, so yours, we're go on. You're, you literally just put sausages on bread and perfect, smashed up perfect, an avocado. Perfect sausage cook. I, I perfect did sausage something cook. for the people. You know, you can't teach mine. Mine's from the heart. You you're you're right about not being able to teach it. Yep. I, I mean, because yeah. you were barely able to do it. So, do you know what? I've only two eggs. Ah! Oh! Oh, do you not cook enough eggs for your wheat dish, man? I didn't. I should have done four. But here, there you go. You only need two. Oh, I've got it. I would, I would drizzle a little bit of oil on top. Oh, we would oil. Yeah, but you know what's good, though? We've both made two incredibly different dishes. But uh -huh. we've, used the, we've used the same sausage. You know what I mean? Just shows you the versatility of a sausage can. You know, a lot of people don't hype the sausage enough. What about this, though? We, for, are, we are hyping. For the grand finish. Oh, here he goes. Oh, there we go. Go ahead, there you go. I'm going to go on the ones that look like they're bare. Arm. Um, bow to me. Oh. Absolutely not. You bow to me. That's sensational. See if I got that. See if I got that in the restaurant. I'd be fucking delighted. I'd send it back to the kitchen. I'd be sending yours back to the vet <laughs> to go, can you still save this pig? <laughs> so raw is the meat. It has now come to the time where we will have Chef Ian come in and try both our dishes and decide which dish is the better dish. Right. Chef Ian, please enter the fray. Here now, Chef Ian, before we taste these, wow. pre presentation is a big part of cooking, as we know. It is indeed. How would you compare both these dishes presentation-wise? Well, both quite different, mm. okay? Two different forms here. I love the simplicity of this one. Yes. Simple. Okay? Yeah, no. Um, it's a bit of an insight into your mind. Lovely. Um, <laughs> Oh, he done me Raw there. And he, done, he done me. He done me there. This, this yeah, absolutely one, done. What's that say about again, his mind? Very symmetrical, very organised. Big as well. portion as well. Uh, yeah. And a big 
big fuck off portion. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. If you were doing yeah. this in a restaurant, would you just take like two of those off? I, I wouldn't do that in a restaurant. <laughs> um, yeah, 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 you wouldn't, right? Mug. We'll get, I agree. Uh, you absolutely would. Mug. We'll, get, we'll get on to the taste of it. Um, oh, it hurt me so bad. It's, it's just for comedy effect. <laughs> that's all. Oh, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Uh, Chef, and we would love you to try these dishes right. now and uh, okay. evaluate. Use the palate. Oh, there's a crisp. Oh, nice, crisp. Nice crisp. Oh, yeah. There's a beautiful yeah, crisp nice, from nice that crisp. coming from yeah. the egg wash, coming from the oil. Oh, look at that. Perfectly cooked through as well. Perfect. Okay. Can you eat? Did you hear that? That was Aye, perfectly that cooked through. Fearfully cooked. Aye. Get right at the back of the palate there. Mm. Think about the honey, the cheese. Think about it all coming together. Aye. Wow. Yeah. Mm. It's a taste sensation. Oh my God. It is a taste sensation. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, if any criticism was there, a little too heavy in the sage maybe? Yeah, I thought so. A little too heavy in the sage? I thought so, okay. But listen, your pastry was crisp, your meat was pastry. cooked and moist. Yes. And the honey comes in straight after the meat and the sage. Oh, yeah, that's as it should be, Chef as it should be. I have day. to say, Thank if you. I was marking that out at 10, Don't that'd be a wonder. strong eight and a half. Genuinely, oh, genuinely. Oh, genuinely. genuinely. You're ruined right now. That's you're ruined right genuinely. now. That is oh, get, get him for the real thing though. No. <laughs> I'm just going to slice the egg first to see if we can oh, yeah. get the moment of the truth. Oh, the money shot. Oh okay. God, here he goes. Oh, oh like, e even that deserves a round of applause. That is, that is. Running uh, like Usain uh, Bolt. Yeah. Huh? So we'll have to get a little bit Running. of here. Wee bit of <laughs> That's a great time. That's Mexico. <laughs> that's Mexico. <laughs> oh yeah. When I think about Mexico, that's the first Ormo, thing that pops into my bakery. <laughs> Los Ormos. Um, Maxi Ormo. <laughs> <laughs> that's Mexico. I'd love you to bring a Mexican person in here and go. Show. Remember? <laughs> that's uh, remember where you're from. If that was a taste sensation. I've just had an orgasm. Well oh, done, sir. Yes. Unbelievable. Yes. Unbelievable. Yes. Unbelievable. Thank you, Chef. Unbelievable. Thanks, Dad. The egg just <laughs> oozed out of the guacamole, the crispy sausages, perfectly toasted soda. That was everything in the one dish. I would serve that in a restaurant. I take that back. Thank Super. you. Super. Super. Well done. Well done. Well done. Good Namaste. Man. Good man. Namaste. Good man. Okay, well guys. Done. We love it. Appreciate Thanks, it. Thanks a million. Oh, what a great time. Sure, we'll call it a draw. <laughs> So thank you for joining us here today at Belfast Cookery School. Big thanks to Hafner's for uh, giving us all these sausages. I was about to say lending them, but they're not getting them back. Big thanks to Chef Ian for all his help and advice and for uh, making me the winner. And also thanks to Aaron Butler, Straw. my competitor, thanks. My, my underling. So Hafner's are running a competition in the month of April to celebrate National Sausage Day, which of course is on the 30th of April. Get on over to nationalsausageday.ie where you could be in with a chance of winning a 2,000 euro holiday voucher. Great times. We're going to go eat this and then go for a wee nap. Not together. Thanks very much. See you later. Mm -hmm. Bye.